Assalamu alaikum, peace be upon you. Welcome. A platform dedicated to fostering harmony and balance in our lives. All mankind is from Adam and Eve. An Arab has no superiority over a non-Arab. Nor does a non-Arab have any superiority over an Arab. A white has no superiority over a black. Nor does a black have any superiority over a white. None have superiority over another except by piety and good action. The farewell sermon of Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, stands as a poignant testament to his unwavering commitment to principles of equality, justice, and compassion. Delivered during his final pilgrimage, this profound address continues to reverberate through the annals of history, offering guidance and inspiration to people of all times and places. Addressing a vast congregation of his followers who had gathered in the vast plain of Arafat, Prophet Muhammad's words echoed with a gravity that transcended the moment. With the radiance of revelation and the weight of a lifetime's wisdom, he delivered a message that would resonate for generations to come. All mankind is from Adam and Eve, Prophet Muhammad proclaimed, immediately affirming the inherent equality of all human beings. In this simple yet profound statement, he erased the artificial divisions that humanity had created over time, divisions of race, ethnicity, and social status. The message was clear. No one is intrinsically superior to another solely based on these external factors. His words continued to dismantle notions of superiority and privilege. An Arab has no superiority over a non-Arab. Nor does a non-Arab have any superiority over an Arab. A white has no superiority over a black. Nor does a black have any superiority over a white. In this unequivocal rejection of racial and ethnic hierarchy, Prophet Muhammad established an unprecedented standard of justice and equality. The essence of his message was distilled in the phrase, none have superiority over another except by piety and good action. Here, he illuminated the true criterion for distinction, not birthright or privilege, but the content of one's character and the righteousness of their deeds. It was a clarion call to judge individuals based on their morals, their compassion, and their contributions to society. Prophet Muhammad's farewell sermon was a blueprint for a just and harmonious society. It shattered the barriers that divided humanity and called for the collective commitment to mutual respect, understanding, and cooperation. It was an exhortation to treat every human being with dignity and empathy, regardless of their background or circumstances. Beyond its immediate impact on his audience, the farewell sermon holds enduring relevance in a world often marred by prejudice, discrimination, and division. It beckons us to embrace our shared humanity, to recognize the intrinsic worth of each individual, and to champion the cause of justice and equality. Prophet Muhammad's legacy lives on through his teachings, his actions, and his profound insights. His farewell sermon stands as a timeless testament to his role as a beacon of light, guiding humanity toward a path of compassion, unity, and righteousness. As we reflect on his words, may we be inspired to uphold the principles he championed and strive to create a world that reflects the spirit of his remarkable message. If you found this content valuable, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more thought-provoking discussions and inspirational insights. Let's spread the message of balance and wisdom together. Share this video with your friends and family, and let them be a part of our growing community too.